Hey guys, so it's finally time to go back to school again. Now whether you're happy or sad about this, you definitely need to be prepared. So how to be prepared? So it depends on which category of students you fall into. Now the first type is the hard worker. If you fall into this category of students, then give yourself a pat on the back because it has been a really challenging time for students as well as teachers. It has been very difficult. It is very very difficult to go and attend classes consistently and to pass up your assignments on time. It really takes a lot of discipline and responsibility to accomplish this. So if you have managed to do this throughout the whole period you are home, then congratulations. I'm really very proud of all my students who have managed to do this. And if you are an SPM candidate, if you are sitting for SPM this year, then it is a big bonus. No other SPM student in history has extra two months to prepare for exam. So if you have really used these two months to the maximum, then you have really gained a very huge advantage for yourself. So when you go back to school, go back holding your head up high and continue your hard work. The second type of students are the students on vacation. You know this type of student. It is the mic mute and video off student. So if you have been this student, then unfortunately you have wasted a golden opportunity. However, it was really a difficult time for everybody. Nobody has ever faced this kind of thing before. So if you have failed to rise up to the occasion, don't worry. But it is time to make up for it. You cannot change the past. You cannot go back in time and you cannot buy lost time. But you can start making smart decisions now and make up for the lost time. This is going to be an extremely difficult task because once you lose momentum, it is very difficult to gain momentum again. However, it is something that you must really work hard on. It takes a lot of determination in order to accomplish this. And so don't give up. Keep working at it and you can do it. The third type of student is the student at a disadvantage. If you fall into this category, if you didn't have good internet connection or if you didn't have stable internet connection, you couldn't attend online classes or there were any other circumstances that prevented you from effective online learning, don't worry because during the whole period of lockdown, many teachers like me have started YouTube channels and we have been recording lessons and uploading them online. So once it is safe to go out again, once this whole lockdown is over, it is safe to go to public where you can get good internet access, you can always go back and access all the lessons that you have missed. We really live in a wonderful time of modern technology. Don't worry, it is all there. All you have to do is spend some time and catch up. No matter what type of student you are, one thing is for sure. When you go back to school, safety is the most important thing that should be on your mind. You will receive many instructions that you may find irritating or unnecessary. But these instructions are there for you and for your safety and for the safety of your loved ones. So don't take them lightly. Always maintain social distancing. Wash your hands regularly with soap. Do not crowd together. Do not move in groups. Remember, you may be strong enough to survive an infection. But can you live with yourself if you pass the infection to someone that you care about and that person cannot survive. Protect yourselves and everyone you care about by simply following the rules. So to all my dear students, all the best and stay safe.